Hey YouTubers and uh, self filmers, um, self filming hunters, I should say. I uh, want to do a quick review on these two remote controls that uh, are made for Sony cameras. Uh, you can see this is my AX100. Uh, these remotes work on uh, the AX 33, 43, 53, um, 6, 3, 6,300, 6,500, 6,600, A7, A9. Um, I'm pretty sure um, all of them that would have the what's called the multi-port uh, connection. Um, so on the left is the uh, Sony uh, factory remote. It's an RM VPR1. On the right is the JJC SR F2. Uh, they're very similar. Um, they both come with two cables. However, the Sony comes with a cable that plugs into the D-shaped uh, Sony older style um, and the JJC comes with another Sony connector that's even different that was even older than the one that this one comes with but anyway they both come with the multi-port uh, so it's not uh, these are only two cables that we're going to be worried about for our application so you can see they're very similar uh, in size uh, they both have removable clamp-on uh, mounts. The JJC does have, uh, it looks like a quarter 20 at the bottom and um, might have to figure out uh, how to use that. But anyway, you can see that uh, the JJC mounts a little bit farther off the handle and the Sony is a little slimmer. Now, I will tell you that when I first received this, um, there was a lot of play in this joint right here in the middle. And you might be able to see here, I added a small O-ring here, and now there's no play at all. It actually um, is, um, is a pretty firm mount there. It doesn't jiggle at all like it did before. So, um, I will tell you that... Uh, the Sony feels, the quality feels a lot better than what the JJC does. Uh, but if this works like I want it to, uh, it'll be just fine. You can see it has uh, the, uh, has different buttons on it. Now I had the Sony originally and it'll clamp on the uh, tripod handle just like this. And it's nice that it's lower profile because uh, it's closer to where your thumb might be. Um, what was odd with this is the power button is on the side, so rather than press the button to turn it on, you actually have to hit this momentary slider on the side to turn the camera on. Um, the wide angle and telephoto has both uh, slow and fast zoom, uh, and the start-stop button is actually kind of recessed. So I don't know if that would present a problem with um, gloves on uh, or not, but it's kind of recessed, so there wouldn't be any accidental hitting that. Uh, it's also, uh, all of these buttons are silent. So this mount mounts on there pretty firmly. There's no chance that uh, I think I could knock it around, you know. So I like this one, uh, the, the, the Sony a lot, so. Uh, it's about double the price, I think, of the JJC. And uh, with respect to the JJC, you can see that it does mount significantly higher and it does present problems with reaching these buttons up here. So what I would have to do is switch the clamp to the other side. Um, and then now I'm able to reach up to these buttons up higher. So what's different about the JJC is 
uh, it does have a light to confirm the camera uh, is plugged in. Uh, it has a button on the top to power on, and it has a grid line button, which toggles through three grid lines before toggling off if that's necessary. Now with a 4K camera, I like the fact that it does have grid lines because I can turn grid lines on and be able to frame uh, a deer in 4K at the proper distance that I want to uh, in case I want to zoom in later. So I will, I will be using that. Uh, it does have um, both fast and slow zoom and the power, the uh, start stop button is not recessed. The one distinctive difference between the JJC and the Sony is, and let me see if you can hear this. These buttons click to give you a confirmation. The Sony is silent. Now, I don't know if that's gonna be a problem. I guess we'll find out this fall when I have it in a tree stand with me. Uh, if that's going to be the case, uh, I would also like to maybe try to find a smaller way to mount this on my handle, and that might include um, this uh, mount hole on the back too. But uh, I do like the fact that the JJC is a lot less expensive, and the fact that it has the power button on the top, and it has this grid line button, uh, one thing I do not like is the click, uh, but we'll wait till this fall to see if that ends up being an issue. So there you have it, the Sony RMVPR1 or the JJC SRF R SRF2 remote controls, wired remote controls for uh, Sony cameras.